Hi, and welcome to another edition of the Toddcast. This week we have on Friday, it's going to be the Hopkins hoop de doo Carnival, and that starts at 5 o'clock and it goes to 8.30 p.m. We have this Saturday, it is the high school prom, so hopefully everyone will have, a little, the kids will have good fun at that. Now, what is happening in our marketplace here in Sherwood? Right now between four hundred and six hundred thousand dollars and $600,000 as far as a list price on homes, we have 15 active listings on the market right now. Now, we have actually 26 pending sales in that same price point. So just letting you know that we have more pending sales than we have active sales. And we're gonna be seeing a little bit more of activity picking up like we normally do this time of year. Especially when uh, being in such a family-driven community, which is another wonderful place, or not, excuse me, another wonderful reasons why we like to live here in Sherwood. Uh, most people make those plans for those moves in conjunction with their kids in school. So hopefully, again, that we'll see some more inventory entering the marketplace. Now, as far as another little reminder, uh, most of our homes here in Sherwood, again, were built from like 1998 up until about 2000. Uh, right around there, it was a large percentage of the homes. Now, most of them are, some of their systems are starting to get a little bit older. So here's a piece of advice. Uh, one of the things we keep coming up on some of our home inspections and most where the surprises lie are in crawl spaces or in attic spaces or actually with roof life. So I would really kind of encourage you too, to, this is a good time, weather gets better, either have someone come over and inspect it or take a look at it, make sure everything in your crawl space is still, especially after the winter, that everything still looks good, there's not like a huge amount of water intrusion or things like that, uh, that your roof has good life because when they get a little bit older, some of the vent boot seals start to fail and they start slowly leaking in attic spaces. And you really wanna kinda of catch those things before they get uh, too damaging. Now, if you need any help or anybody, because we have a lot of good either inspectors or even local contractors who are more than willing to come out and just check that stuff out for you. So if you need any names, please feel free to give us a call. Hope you all have a great week and are enjoying the weather, and I'll see you next time on the Toddcast. Thanks.